want to check in once again from the house. Today is July 27, 2016. Wanted to bring you guys in the vlog. I haven't really done a vlog in a while. I've only been doing a lot of lifting videos. Um, the lifting video will come later in the video. I guess that's the format that I'm going to be following. Um, so, what's new with me today? Uh, I'm going to probably do... Not sure exactly. Everything is kind of sore. I've been hitting a lot of... Um, sorry, my house is a mess right now. Gym time. Not in the garage gym. It's like 110 degrees on average here in Lynn Empire, Southern California for the last few weeks actually so I've been lifting um, in several other gyms other than my garage um, as you guys can see here I have a new tattoo I've been thinking about this tattoo for quite a long time now quick little tip if you want a tattoo think for it think about it for at least most of your life you know what I mean it's gonna be in the in your body for a long time I wouldn't get a tattoo if you're under the age of 18 I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend getting a tattoo if you're under the age of you know say 25 because around that time you have pretty much matured and you've actually become the person that you've wanted to be not necessarily where you want to be but someone that you think that you're gonna be for the rest of your life pretty much a water buffalo um, most of you don't know that I pretty much was born in a in poverty you know wasn't really poor but I was actually you know in in um, in the province of Philippines. I, I grew up under a volcano, it's called Mayon Volcano, um, in Legaspi, Bicol, Philippines. Um, pretty much the animal that I associated, I'm really starting to peel by the way, I associated myself with the most was the water buffalo. Water buffalo was pretty much the beast of burden for us Filipinos. Um, you know, it was the, it was basically the, the machine that we used to move earth to make the farms that fed basically every person in the village it was um it meant it means to me strength and hard work it's a stubborn beast i'm very stubborn myself um you know what i mean so it's pretty docile pretty nice domesticated animal but it's not something you really want to mess with because it will mess you up so that's why i really really like the uh the national animal of the philippines well the things below it as you can see those, it's not done yet, and I still need another session. I'm going to get another session done in a few weeks once this part heals. Um, it's the Sempaguita flowers. I remember growing up when I was young, growing up in the Philippines. Um, I would go to church every Sunday. Um, I, re I remember watching, you know, the poorer kids. I was, we weren't that poor. We were, you know, kind of well-to-do for the rest of the Filipinos, as evidenced by me being in America. I moved to America when I was eight. Um, but I remember all the poor kids would make necklaces out of those flowers, um, try to sell it, try to help their parents, you know, put food on the table, try to feed themselves, try to get everything they want. Um, it's, it was a much different environment, you know, back in the Philippines than it is, than my life is here now. Obviously, I'm doing a little bit better than I was back then, but pretty much every social, religious gathering that we had, um, we would always have the national flower of the Philippines, the Sampaguita. National flower, national animal, um, the Sempaguita flower. They're, they have the Sempaguita is also known as jasmine. So you know, <laughs> everybody knows what jasmine flowers is and jasmine flower smells like. So anytime I come across it or smell it or see it here, it um, kind of you know I get very nostalgic. Kind of reminds me of my youth um, back home. Kind of uh, reminds me of who I am and where I came from. Damn, I look disgruntled right now. Anyways. That's a little quick talk about my tattoo. You know, I'm really happy. Also, another reason that triggered me to getting a tattoo is I turned 30 in about a month's time, so I really wanted to do something different. Um, I really wanted to put something on my body that kind of um, makes me recognize who I am and where I come from and where I've been. And, you know, strength and hard work and uh, reminds me of my youth. All right, so I'm going to go get myself a nice little workout today. Like, if you've been watching my videos, I pretty much don't really plan anything. I'm pretty sore all over, so whatever um, my body feels like doing, I'll kind of take it from there, and, and then we'll see what's up. All right, guys. Uh, like and subscribe. Um, if you like my vlogging, this vlogging style with my phone, let me know, and uh, I will continue to do more so in the future. Oh, and by the way, I'm 185 pounds today, guys. Um been doing intermittent fasting for almost three weeks now, so I want to do a little video about that and my progress with it. All right, guys, enjoy the video. Peace.
drink some hate up. But people I don't have the time to hang with Always look at me and say the same shit say, You promise me you don't have a I just feel like you broke a promise to me Only hurt cause I thought you were being honest with me So I'm gonna try and do this honorably Without the sponsor fee What's most alarming to me This is emotional for you Robust such as the calm in me Easy to put off notes and thugs harmony Speak to his insecurities Acting so irresponsibly And it's further impacted by the fact that you respond to me See some of us know you as Jimmy Belly Ole. He had the baby belly frill Nigga was frail up in his clothes Really got a hole in this seeming very out of control Wish we can go back and grab the blackberry with the scroll oh. Yeah, Aubrey, that's the one we trusted Not this new Aubrey with his stomach sculpted I'm disgusted, you're such a fucking incumbent Can't govern trust of the public becoming a fucking puppet It's bigger than rap battles A word for the digital cash castle Don't let it glitch in the Mac crash I'm the last win, political trap tackle Now class pass with that, the original bad habits. I know where you at, shit, I was there too When shit was happening fast, word I got scared too Impossible feats, impossible to sleep Making promises impossible to keep like What am I afraid of? This is supposed to be what dreams are made of But people I don't have the time to hang with Always look at me and say the same Let me talk this nigga, man Listen Alert the niggas to handle you Fill up tour seats, but you raw meat to the animals Doggy the cannibal, morning coffee and sandal shoes Can't get this energy off me, it ain't tangible This shit is greater than me, pitchfork and fade to agree Complex, I'm waiting to see, this between us A and B You want the cusp rated G, feel my ain't paying to see I'm patiently waiting with please, thought you were taking and breathe Blatantly see this whole channel, real A and E Part the sound empty inside and fill a vacancy Get some advice, come over, kick it and vibe I'm here with hotel strippers, Odell, all that shit that you like We'll light some candles and some hookah, hookahs flicking the lights We'll play Aaliyah's greatest hits, you'll get all tickled inside, my nigga It's no wonder you losing all your friends Post the channel now for all that you had on wall again And tell your mans I'll be seeing them soon We march you right into this madness, I got reason to assume My creep in his room, sweep a consume Now it's region of doom, ain't the legion of boom It's just me with a broom Afterward, I'm thinking we can resume Lesson is speaking too soon, how's it too? Too late if I'm reading your tune, it's not Boys in ordinance, boys in ornaments Show up at party next door with a noise ordinance So off the hook of me, maybe y'all should be shook of me Should know I kill him at even the slightest push of me And when his team press up shirts, I help him push a tee Shoot it, read, he press buttons but wouldn't push a tee Gotta be bugging, maybe he don't know what push should be Or when push a push the agenda, he didn't push the seat If push to the streets, I see wooden your physique Thinking you misunderstood my hood, this isn't Meek, nigga. Same standard that you couldn't meet. Just from your views, you probably couldn't see. It's cool that kind of success, but never plan for it. I heard the question, nigga. I'ma help you answer it. This is supposed to be what dreams are made of. But people like you can't be wrong. Always look at me and say the same shit. You promise me you